Why do some British people not like Donald Trump? He has no class, no charm, no coolness, no credibility, no compassion, no wit, no warmth, no wisdom, no subtlety, no sensitivity, no self-awareness, no humility, no honor and no grace. All qualities, funnily enough, with which his predecessor Mr. Obama was generously blessed. Plus, we like a laugh. And while Trump may be laughable, he has never once said anything wry, witty or even faintly amusing. Not once, ever. I don't say that rhetorically, I mean it quite literally. Not once, not ever. He doesn't even seem to understand what a joke is. His idea of a joke is a crass comment, an illiterate insult, a casual act of cruelty. Trump is a troll. And like all trolls, he is never funny and he never laughs. He only crows or jeers. And scarily, he doesn't just talk in crude, witless insults, he actually thinks in them. His mind is a simple bot-like algorithm of petty prejudices and knee-jerk nastiness. He's not even a spoiled rich boy or a greedy fat cat. He's more a fat white slug, a jabber the hut of privilege. And worse, he is that most unforgivable of all things, a bully. He punches downwards, which a gentleman should, would, could never do, and every blow he aims is below the belt. He particularly likes to kick the vulnerable or voiceless, and he kicks them when they are down. This last point is what especially confuses and dismays many other people too, his faults seem pretty bloody hard to miss. After all, it's impossible to read a single tweet, or hear him speak a sentence or two, without staring deep into the abyss. He turns being artless into an art form, he is a Picasso of pettiness, a Shakespeare of shit. His faults are fractal, even his flaws have flaws. God knows there have always been stupid people in the world, and plenty of nasty people too. But rarely has stupidity been so nasty, or nastiness so stupid. He makes Nixon look trustworthy and George W. Bush look smart. In fact, if Frankenstein decided to make a monster assembled entirely from human flaws, he would make a Trump. And a remorseful Dr. Frankenstein would clutch out big clumpfuls of hair and scream in anguish, my god, what, have, I, created,